St. Lawrence Seaway takes a major stride towards completion north of Messina, New York, and with it, a great international hydroelectric power development through the creation of Lake St. Lawrence. 1,000 official spectators are on hand, including the chairman of Ontario's Hydroelectric Commission, New York's Governor Harriman and Robert Moses, along with some 55,000 others awaiting the big moment. Thirty tons of dynamite blast open a 600-foot copper dam that held the river from the site of the world's largest man-made lake. In three days, it will cover 100 square miles, enabling sea-going vessels to sail smoothly through the former international rapids. An achievement that brings nearly to completion the taming of the great river that drains the great lakes and almost half the continent.